The effectiveness of nitrogen fertilizer is determined mainly by its percentage mass of nitrogen. Okay. Rank the following fertilizers in terms of their effectiveness, potassium nitrate, ammonium nitrate, and ammonium sulfate. So you might be thinking, well, well how do I do this? We've never done anything quite like this. Okay, so don't panic. That's the key in chemistry, don't panic. But all you have to do is just think about what it's actually asking you. Just find the percentage mass of nitrogen in these different chemicals. Okay. So let's take ammonium nitrate first. Ammonium is NH4. Nitrate is NH NO3. Ammonium has valency of plus one. Nitrate has valency of minus one. So you can see that works out perfectly. For every ammonium nitrate molecule, you get two nitrogen atoms, okay? So we've got the molar mass of nitrogen, and then is 14. And so we add them together, and you get 28.01. The total molar mass of the ammonium nitrate is 80.052, okay? So you just take the division of those two and then multiply by 100. And so the percentage mass is about 35%. Okay, so it's about, it's just bigger than a third of it is nitrogen. Okay, what about ammonium sulfate? Remember ammonium has valency of plus one. Sulfate has valency of minus two. So for every one sulfate ion, we need two ammonium ions. So that's why you have two there. And again, there's two nitrogens for every one ammonium sulfate molecule. So there's 28.01 again. And then if we divide by the molar mass of the ammonium sulfate, and we can actually work that out using our periodic table, just add up all of the molecular or molar masses of each element, we get 132.154. So obviously you can see it's gonna be a smaller percentage than this one because this number is so much bigger than this one. So we get 21.2% of it is nitrogen of this particular fertilizer, okay? So in this fertilizer, because the sulfate adds so much mass, the percentage mass of nitrogen is much lower, okay? What about KNO3? So again, potassium has valency of one, uh, potassium ion that is. Nitrate ion has valency of negative one. Put them together, that works out perfectly. But in this case, it only has 14, it only has one nitrogen for every one molecule. So it's got 14, grams per mole divided by 101.11, which is the molar mass of this thing. Okay, so this is a very big number. 14 is quite a small number. So the percentage is only 13.86%. So it's only 13.86%. So obviously you can see the winner in this one. Most effective is NH4NO3. Next most effective is the ammonium sulfate. And then the least effective is the KNO3. Okay, so there's second most effective and third most effective.